Hi, it's Gavin Keane from Cloud Made Simple. Um, um, would like to take a couple of minutes of your time to talk about an important security update. Uh, the reason for this is we're seeing an unprecedented amount of mailbox uh, email attacks. Uh, email attacks via the way of spoofing, phishing and ransomware. And we're seeing more businesses than ever reporting hacks and actually being hacked. Uh, again, this is not a matter of if it's going to happen. Unfortunately, it's when it's going to happen. Now, if we take a look at what spoofing is, it's when you're getting emails from someone you, you know, but it's actually not them. So they're actually hijacking their identity. And how this happens is if someone uh, gets hacked, uh, basically they take over the email account and then they'll send an email to all the contacts within that particular email box. So uh, it's like a virus that goes and spreads from one hacked user to another hacked user, etc. Uh, phishing emails are usually links or attachments. And they're looking for information, any sort of information they can get to be able to hack into your account. And then there's ransomware, where basically it's a, a virus that comes in and actually takes over your computer and uh, they, they ask for money to, to, to basically be able to regain your data. So unfortunately, as I said, there's an unprecedented amount of attacks happening at this moment. And so we really um, want you to take this extremely seriously. And we're recommending that you put three things, three tool, key tools in place. One of them is Office 365 Advanced Threat Protection. The other is Multi-Factor Authentication. And the other is Azure Active Directory Premium One. They're three licenses from Microsoft. Uh, this will protect your Office 365 environment. So not only your, your Outlook in your mail, but your, uh, if you're using SharePoint, your OneDrive and other Office applications. But we also recommend you look at your server security, so you've got backups in place all the time, your cloud app security, your website and your network security. It's really important you cover all these particular areas. But because at the moment there's so many malicious email attacks, uh, we really want to focus purely on that at the moment and talk about those, those, those three license types. I'll quickly go through what each of those license uh, is, does or how they protect you. So advanced threat protection really protects you against uh, attachments and uh, links that you might get set through these attacks. So if you actually click on one of the links uh, or attachment, it actually gets opened up within a Microsoft sandbox. And if that's determined to be malicious, it actually won't then get sent through to your mailbox. You'll never receive that. So even if you do receive one of these emails, if you are protected even if you do click on it. So that's really important, that's the first step. The second step is to get multi-factor authentication. This is becoming more and more relevant. So if, when you log into your Office 365, you'll be asked for a second form of identification, whether that's an SMS to, to your mobile, uh, email to a secondary email account uh, before you can actually access your Office 365. So that means if you do get compromised by someone and they're overseas or around the corner, doesn't matter where, they'll be asked for a secondary code and they won't have access to that. So it, if, if you've got a poor password, this is going to prevent them actually hacking into your account. The third thing that we recommend strongly is something called Azure Active Directory. Uh, this is, uh, this is a, a, a license which gives you the ability to centralise the identity management in your organisation. Uh, it provides employees with an easy single sign-on experience and it's where you quickly adopt cloud services through App Directory and a range of uh, integrations. It is a fantastic tool uh, to also uh, monitor your applications and uh, has fantastic reporting on security. It's, a, it's also where it's that single sign-on where you put all your applications and your custom applications in one spot to be able to access them. So then it stops people, even if they hack into your computer, being able to potentially get into just applications that are sitting on, on your desktop. So this, uh, these are the three things that we, that we really, really recommend. It's not expensive. Uh, 
those combinations of those licenses is going to be an additional ten dollars ninety per user per month onto your Office three six five subscription. So it's not a lot of money. Uh, there is going to be a one off cost of approximately nine hundred and ninety dollars to set up those three particular licenses for your for your company. Uh, it might cost a bit more if it's it's a, if it's a larger company, but we can assess that once we once we have a chat to you and and, and see what needs to be set up. Um, I'm really imploring you to have a, have a serious look at this um, only because we've just seen so many hacks uh, being happened at the moment and some horror stories about what this has cost business. So please give us a call um, on, your, on your local CloudMade Simple number or send a support email into support at simpleid.com and, and, and we will do absolutely our best uh, to make sure that we implement these things to keep you, keep you safe. Thanks very much for your time. Bye.